All right, Gabby. I'm all right, mate. How are you? Yeah, I'm all right, mate. I'm you all right. right. Yeah, I'm you hanging sure? in there, mate. I'm hanging in there. You sure, mate? Yeah, it's, uh, it's been it's, a tough week. It's been a bad week. <laughs> 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 it's been a tough week. Been a I've tough had you week, digging man. me out. I've had Alan digging me out. And then Spurs go and get pumped by Newcastle. Yeah, it's been a, been a tough week. Tough just, week, mate. Oh, man, I just, don't, I just don't understand Spurs. I'm looking at this game today and I'm like, you got, you got your best players available. There's no like moaning about injuries now for Spurs. Everyone's available. And you're going to lose 4-0. I mean, that Jacob Murphy at right back. Anderson plays when he doesn't really start. The injuries that they've got Newcastle to beat you so comfortably. Yeah. Nowhere near good enough today, mate. I mean, I, I was speaking to Aid a little bit earlier, and I, I, it was just look. When you lose that game, you, you, Inquest have to be. You have to look at it and go right. Come on, you know we're, we're a team that's trying to get Champions League football, mm-hmm. looking to you know kick on as a football club, and we play against these top sides now. We're getting pumped. Yeah. You know, you, you, you want to play out from the back. You want to play this high line. I get it. But there also has to be a, a moment in some games where you go, hold on. You know, we're away from home. We're playing against a, a Newcastle side yeah. who, are, who want to run riot. You know, sit in, be hard to beat, be resilient, and then our football will come through and rely on players to hit teams on the break. We just want to free flow teams and turn up yeah. every week. I mean, you know, Stuart Pearce said it earlier. Yeah. I mean, an eight-year-old can figure out how to beat Tottenham. It's ridiculous. You know what, though? Um, jokes aside, and we have banter about Spurs, this and that, but... Villa were just as bad, mate. I, w- I watched the game on Thursday against Lille in the um, Europa League conference, and they should have scored five, six. If it wasn't for Emi Martinez. I mean, he's making incredible saves. You know, you watch your team, and you're just seeing, like, players just stroll through, yeah. not following runners. Yeah. Little movement in behind, and they're through on goal. Spurs and Villa are so similar, and that's the reason why they're at fourth and fifth yeah. and not chasing the top three. I mean... If you look at the goal difference, like, I mean, Villa and Spurs both oh. conceded 49 goals. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, if you want to go much. that level higher to start fighting for titles, you can't concede that many goals. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, n- nowhere near good. I want to hear from Spurs fans. I know it's the early kick off Newcastle and Spurs, but I want to come on and talk about it because it's a big win for Newcastle. They're still in their hunt for potentially maybe a, a top, you know, top five. I you mean, never know, mate. all of a sudden they've you come back know. into it and you look at Newcastle and say, well, they could have a decent season. It was only talk of Eddie Howe potentially getting a sack. But that was crazy though, Jamie. Look at the fixtures. Spurs' next three Premier League games. Tough, Arsenal, Chelsea and Liverpool. I know, mate. No, you always struggle against Chelsea. They're, they're your bogey team a bit. Arsenal, yeah. Liverpool fighting for the title. You could lose them three games. Newcastle yeah. win their three and you're like, whoa, 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 yeah. whoa, whoa. Could this happen? <laughs> Where you lose like fifth fifth will probably get Champions League fifth as well. Fifth point gets Champions and League. Like, Spurs pretty no, sixth. No, no. I'll go no, I'll, I'll leave. I will leave Talk Sport if that happens. I swear. I will not be able to face Imagine. it. Imagine. No, oh, don't. The one season we get Champions League football is fifth and Spurs finish sixth. Wow. No, it can't happen. Uh, let's go to Chris, who's a Spurs fan. All right, Chris. Good evening, Chris. Yeah, good evening, gentlemen. How are we doing? I'm good, mate. I'm good. Better I'm... than you, mate. Yeah. How are you? Been to the game, I eh? Was there... I was there this afternoon. It was embarrassing. It... We had no idea. We play out from the back while our fullbacks took into midfield. Yeah. Newcastle, Newcastle, every single time, absolutely swamped. Yeah. From, the, from, from our 18-yard area. And our, and our plan B... He's just carry on with plan A. When he works, we've seen it. When he works, he's brilliant. He's attacking. He's free flowing. When he doesn't work, it's absolutely embarrassing. Yeah. Fulham, Fulham did it. It's, yeah. You know, you know what's starting to annoy me, Chris? Ange, Ange thinks we're still playing in Scotland. Like oh. we ain't in Scotland anymore, Ange. You ain't Celtic, and you're playing against terrible sides every week. You're playing against top sides. You want to play like this football, week in, week out, playing open, gung-ho style football. You're going to get done. You're going to get smashed up. That's what the fans are saying. All they kept talking about is he thinks it's as easy as the Scottish Prem, and it it isn't. And if we don't have a plan B, then teams are going to work us out. Newcastle has worked us out from five minutes. Werner should have put us 2-0 up. He had two chances. He needs about six to score. And we're in bother. We're in bother, Jamie. Can I ask you a question, Chris? Spurs, Spurs, don't, Spurs don't play now for, is it... Um, oh, two weeks. Yeah, two weeks, right. Yeah, Why is he bringing Son off after 59 minutes? The captain, I know he was at his best, but Son will get upset at that. He's sort of player that won't be happy. But when Sonny plays down the middle like he did today, he's not, he's, he can't make it stick. The ball was bouncing off him. And, in fact, two of Newcastle goals came from Sonny at the edge of their box. Oh, yeah, yeah, it did. 
Son lost it twice. I know, but you, you, you lose. You know, Son loses it on the edge of the box, Chris. You know, you're not expecting it to be in the back of your exactly, net. Yeah. You know, 15 seconds yeah. later, come on. I mean, two balls straight over the top, two goals. I mean, that's not good enough. You're scared to give the ball away on the edge of the box because you think it's going to end up in the back of your net. It's bad. Yeah, but there was nobody. The, the, the line Foster Cogler wants to play with our fullback playing as attacking midfielders. We only have. There was only Van der Ven making any sort of attempt to get back. I know. Romero, Romero was nowhere to be seen for two of the goals. Yeah. I don't know. No wonder Van der Ven looks like he's going to do his Ami every week because he's constantly oh, having no, to he's... sprint backwards. You're right, Jamie. It's dangerous. Yeah. But we've, we've been found out. When we get found out, we look. We, when, we, when, we, when we play well, we're brilliant. But when we get found out, it is embarrassing to watch. Yeah. And, and, and last, that's in two seasons, it's 10 1. It's embarrassing. I want my money back from today. I've tweeted Tottenham today. <laughs> I'm not ticket and I've asked them for my money back. All the best for that, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel Levy will be like, uh, turn the Twitter off. <laughs> Log off. Yeah, Daniel Levy's gone missing. Smurf's, Social media's yeah, gone missing. Smurf's Twitter's been logged off. <laughs> Don't know the password. <laughs> <laughs> Two weeks without a game. Put it back on a day before the game. Two pitches of training. <laughs> Yeah, got no chance getting them ticket money back today, mate. No chance. You should because it was shocking, but that's part and parcel of following your team around, I'm sorry to say. And, uh, yeah, Newcastle seems to be a bit of a nightmare for us at the moment.